Hey everybody, it's Aplin Spiritual, another reading. So this is going to be a nighttime reading. A little nighttime love in here. So we have the angels here. Spiritual guidance, protection from harm. So you are protected right now from any harm. Let's just get some current energy. It's going to be a little quick reading, just a little, little uh, high, you know, a little high reading. Hi to all my peoples out there. Thank you to all my new subscribers and my oldies out there. Um, I hope you guys had a great day today. And I know you saw my, my last reading. That shit was so cool. I know, it's what I'm saying. So, you know, I love you guys beyond, right? We're a family on here. So, yeah, someone said to me in the comments, like, are you going to make merch? I'm like... Yeah, hello, duh. But that's in the future, baby. When I'm a big star, you know what I'm saying? But for now, while I'm growing, you know, one day I want to do, you know, a giveaway and stuff like that. Because I have a, a tarot deck in there that I want to give away to somebody. I will do that one day. Maybe in the near future. When I start getting more subscribers and shit. So... Let's find out what is going on right this moment, right when you click on this. Let's see what's happening here for all the peeps out there. Let's see. What's the current energy right now? And it is the full moon energy we're going into. There's a lot of stuff happening. There's like trines and just the energy is so high right now. All right, I'm seeing like there's a secret admirer that could be someone that's coming into your life very soon. Let's see. Deep friendship with some of the same someone of the same sex here. That could be someone you're getting in touch with here. Could be a man you're dealing with here. Dealings or relationship with a man. This could be someone, ooh, a man and a dark woman here. Dealings or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. These two people could be significant that want to have a conversation with you. Like right now, like very soon. Expect to hear from these people like within the few days that are coming in here. Like this is like very soon here. Club, someone will try to make you do something against your will. October, maybe this is connected to a Libra Scorpio energy here. Maybe this is these people. Hmm. Very important, very important here. Bird perched, waiting for news package or letter. You could be waiting for uh, for news from these people here. Maybe this is about an invitation, a get-together. Weeping willow, family sorrow. Maybe it's just uh, people in your family here. So what else? What else is the energies right now? What's very important right this moment for the peeps watching? It could be involvement with the law. Okay, so spirit's saying great worry over nothing right now. You're worried over nothing. You don't have to worry. If these people are burdening you or there's something where they're... You're waiting for news from these people. Spirit saying, don't worry, because you're worrying yourself for nothing. Everything's going to be okay. So what else is happening here? What else is important? Spear, heartache over what you no longer have. So there could be heartache from this man, from this person, maybe both of these people, but particularly this man. This person could have hurt your heart. Hmm. This female... Could be an Aries, Capricorn, year of the goat here. They could be a stubborn, aggressive person. But this is somebody that maybe other people fear, but they're an authority. You know, they could be a leader. They could be your boss or someone that wants to work with you. This is somebody that is abundant, increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. This person could be very spiritual as well. This female. This could be someone that's coming in to increase your wealth. Maybe they're going to offer you some kind of opportunity very quickly that's going to change your life yeah pay attention to your work this person this female is coming in to offer you some kind of position because they feel like you deserve it you're the perfect candidate for this could be around libra or a libra person keep your life in balance yeah even though you're waiting for this this news package or letter spirit saying you know stay balanced here you know, don't be all over the place. Control your emotions because it's great worry over nothing. 
okay? Maybe go hang out with your friends, enjoy the moment, have some tea, have some coffee, happiness and well-being, because around right now, Leo season is when you're going into this. You don't need to worry. Everything's going to be fine. You're going to be going into happiness and well-being. Again, you have tea, tea cups here. You should accept valid criticism. Someone's going to give you great advice and it's going to make you feel better. It could be about this person. You know, it could be coming from someone that you trust, someone that you consider your friend. They're going to be giving you some great advice. Beware of great pride. Yeah, so don't let your pride get in the way. You know, people could be seeing you as this female as well. Like you could be this dark woman. You know, maybe you're getting some kind of money, an opportunity that you feel like you're a big shot. Just make sure you, your pride doesn't get in the way, you know. But enjoy yourself, you know, live your best life. Yeah, maybe people think you're aggressive or you're this type of energy, you know what I mean? Maybe you have water placements as well. You could have Leo placements, but this also, like I said, could be someone that's coming into your life that they have a lot of pride in who they are. They, you know, they, they built themselves up from the ground up, you know what I mean? This person had no help from anybody. So they could be, you know, a person that's very powerful that people see as someone that's very aggressive, but they're going to show you a different side. Maybe they want to be your friend. Chinese year of the dog getting together with friends. December, so they could be Sagittarius Capricorn here. Scorpio, something could be happening in December, the winter months. Someone is extremely stubborn and unwilling to change. Firecracker excitement. So there's definitely a change that's happening here, but... There could be someone in your life or this is you that doesn't want to change. Maybe you don't want to take this opportunity. It's very exciting, especially if you have fireplace, but especially Sagittarius here. But you have good luck on your side and guaranteed success. Look at this. So it's about you taking a risk, taking a leap of faith. Use your intuition. So because I'm hearing it, it could be like a lose-lose type of thing. Like you're losing out on something that you didn't even give a chance to because you're too stubborn. So it could end up being a lose-lose situ situation here. Maybe there's something about this female that you don't trust. Maybe you heard things about this person. Maybe get to know this person first before you judge them. Maybe they want to go out with you. Maybe they want to be your friend. Maybe they want to treat you to something and then offer some kind of opportunity to you. Maybe you never looked at this person like that because maybe they've always been like, you know, kind of like, like all that, you know, like they think if they're the best person and like, like the world revolves them or something. But maybe once you get to know them, you're going to end up being like best friends with this person. They could have tourist placements. And maybe they're going to give you advice about this man, but there's something about chair filled here. Someone new entering your life. This could be someone completely new. Like I said, you don't even know who this is, but for some reason... Spirit wants you to know that this is like very important here. Unsuccessful plans. I feel like this man had some unsuccessful plans. You know, maybe you know this person like they hurt you before. They went their own way somewhere else. Something was unsuccessful. They're coming back. But there's a two-faced friend here. Chinese here, the cat, Aries. Celebration, fun, and enjoyment feel like somebody could be inviting you out and maybe it's to benefit them and not you Chinese here the dragon is here Taurus but in the end it's actually going to work out for you yeah good advice from a wise person someone's definitely going to give you some kind of good advice this man could be inviting you out you know and you're going to get good advice from this this woman here opportunity or windfall Ooh, that's nice candle you will be shown the way so there's some kind of opportunity or windfall and you will be shown the way here so pay attention because with this opportunity or windfall you're going to be able to uh, build a solid foundation and with success there will be effort here oh hold on yeah i keep hearing that song hey hey do, 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 do. Yeah, yeah. Do, 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 do. All right. Fair man is here. Dealings or relationship with a man, blonde, gray, or white hair. Hey, hey. Yeah, yeah. Major challenge to overcome. This person's gone through a challenge in their life. 
whoever this is. And for some reason, they're showing up in this reading. So, they, yeah, they could be a fire sign. Strong emotion, passionate love or hate. This person either has extreme love for you or hatred towards you. I don't know what's going on here. But, yeah, it could be connected to your money. Or, again, there's a money path waiting for you to find it. So, you just got to, you know, open up the channels I'm hearing. Ten. Temporary situation. So, the situation you're in right now, it's temporary. So, you know, that's why the whale came up, like, great worry over nothing. Caterpillar, things will not always be this way. A change is coming because it's a temporary situation, all right? Yeah, and especially with your money and finances, it's a temporary situation, you know? So don't get all worried. This card was left behind. Yeah, stepping into a new experience. That's exactly what's happening here. And we have casket. Someone going out of your life or the end of a situation and I, and I just heard the end of being poor. So if that's your situation, that's changing. And let's get my homemade cards for just a quick energy. Really quick here. Quick, really quick energy. Quick, quick, quick. Let's see. What's the energy right now? Right now. For whoever's watching, whatever their question is. Oh, hold on on the floor embrace change there you go embrace that change money's coming money is on its way to you right now yeah and it's part of a new path embrace this change embrace embrace this new path especially because real love's coming you're not gonna have any bullshit here it's gonna be a soul connection oh my gosh it's a soulmate here soul connection soulmate i mean are you serious what are you doing right now? Yeah. Listen to that higher self. Your higher self's trying to tell you this. Pay attention. Yeah, because you're meeting someone new very quickly here. This is quick energy here. Very quick. Yeah, and you were staying stuck for a while and you're going to be getting unstuck. I'm telling you, this is happening very, very quickly. Like within the next few days, you're going to be feeling this energy. Especially with this full moon and all this stuff that's happening right now. Yeah, you're going to be on some kind of lucky streak. Wow. Yeah, and you're going to be dating. Ooh. So since you're going to be dating me and someone new, let's pull some love cards. Love, love, love. Love. Let's see. For the peeps watching right now, this quick reading here. Let's see. Yeah, look at this Cupid's arrow. Have faith. Love is coming. Look, surprise invitation or meeting, Has it, you're hesitating with this. You're like, oh my gosh, should I do this? Should I not? Someone could have stabbed you in the back before because I just saw that card. So we have mirroring each other, self-image. Re re relationships reflect our wounds here. So maybe you feel like you're meeting someone and they're mirroring you because again, they're your soulmates. So they're going to be mirroring you. Not showing true feelings, high personified gaslighting. I feel like at first when you meet this person, you're going to be a little bit on your guard. You know, because you've been hurt so many times. Yeah, you definitely experienced some kind of breakup separation. But Spirit's saying, yeah, stop the pattern. Don't act like that because this is real love here. This is unconditional love that's coming. And if you truly love yourself, your heart chakra is going to be open. You're not going to be in this, this energy of like being um, defensive and not allowing love in your life. You know what I mean? Like you need to be more transparent with the energy relationship evolving to the next phase you could be seeing a lot of butterflies and you're healing the inner child but a lot of you sadly deal with narcissists in your life a lot of one-sided relationships love bombing but that's all changing now yeah you deal with some kind of snake chinese here the snake could be a gemini where they could have put you in a third party situation or there was like a love triangle going on here. This could be someone coming back to you as well that wants to sabotage something new in your life because you're rebuilding yourself. They want to maybe try again with you, but I don't think you're going to be doing that because you have the real love coming, the unconditional love. And let's get some of these and then that's it for this reading. Are you serious, life partner? A lot of you, this energy is bringing a life partner, like the love of your life, divine counterpart. 
Yeah, and this is part of your karma. It's part of the lessons in this life for you that you deserve. Hold on, this fell on the floor. Hey, hey. Do, 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 do. Spend time together. Yeah, you could be going on some kind of little, uh, little travel, maybe a little beach park, whatever, spending time with this person. Maybe you're gonna be talking it out, something here. Or this person, like, this is going to be, like, your first date. It's going to be, like, very intimate. Yeah, read in between read in between the lines. This is something very obvious here. It's going to be, like, in your face, very obvious. Spirit's going to be, like, okay, read in between the lines here. <clears throat> something that connected to children or your inner child. Yeah, and the universe has a plan with love. Look at this. And blessings are on their way to you. Blessings are coming your way right now. You're going to feel very lucky with this four-leaf clover. So that's all I have for you. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Woo! My chest. My throat. I'm ready to rock here. Maybe your, your throat chakra is opening up. You're going to be expressing yourself more. Being more open with your feelings. Open up that heart chakra, baby. Let that love in. All right? And that's it. You know, enjoy your life. Live your best life every day. I'm here for you. We got everybody on here. We're all here for each other. I love you guys. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this little night reading. And I'll see you in the next one. Namaste. Love and light.